<laughs> Hi guys, it's Buddy. We have a lot of feels from uh, getting the Tokyo Disneyland ticket from Family Mart. Um, so this time we're gonna go to USJ, uh, which is Universal Studio Japan. If you don't know the short form of it. Um, <clears throat> and they also offer a company, which is a convenience store version of their ticket. So、um, this time we're gonna show you how to get a ticket from Lawson instead of Family Mart. Because、uh, Family Mart only sells、uh, Disneyland ticket. And while Lawson. On the other hand, we'll sell the、uh, Universal Studio Japan、uh, ticket. So, we're gonna show you how to do it.、Um, the video was taken last night, so I'll show you now. Okay, so this time we're gonna、uh, use Lawson system to get tickets for USJ. So, first you need to press the input a number. And then、um, from the website, you can find the code. I will link it down in the description.、Um, we are gonna get a one day pass, so it's gonna be 50055. And next. And they will tell you you can resell it, blah blah blah. And just close. And press. Oh, and wait for it to load. <laughs> so we're gonna go on January 3rd, so next month, and the 3rd. So you make sure you're getting what you need. And next. So it's a one day studio pass that we want, so press the button again. So the top we have、uh, adults, kids, and senior. We have two people going, so we go up twice. And next. So make sure you got what you need, and there's stuff that you need to know. Blah blah blah, and confirm. So if you don't have pointer card, you just press cross, and you need to type in your name. You can use English. And phone number. You can always use your hotel's phone number for this. So make sure what it's what you want. Yes. Okay. It's gonna come out from here. Now you just need to go to the cashier and pay for it. So they will take it. So the ticket looks something like this. 
I'm covering the QR code because probably this video is gonna come out before we actually head to USJ. So just to be safe. Uh, the ticket will come out from the printer behind the guy. So they will give you the ticket and it's nothing fancy, it's just plain paper and with the words Lawson all over the, the, the ticket just to show them that you know you bought it from there but um yeah so there's pros and cons uh, if you want a fancy ticket that has usj design on it you probably should go to the ticket counter to get it because um you know the loss of one just don't have any design of usj on it um but then it is uh, conven much more convenient because you don't need to line up for it and probably everyone is heading there quite early to rush into Harry Potter land or Harry Potter world um, but yeah anyways um, so make sure you check the website I'll link it down below uh, for the code that you punch in into the machine. The website itself will send you to the English instruction of how to get the ticket. So what we have done in the video is basically following what they did, uh, the, what they show you on the English website. But um, <clears throat> for the quotes, you need to click on a part saying that oh, if you want a one-day ticket click here if you want a two-day ticket click here uh, if you want to express pass click here so you need to click on that to find out uh, what quote you need to punch into the machine so once you clicked on the link it will direct you to the Japanese website USJ Japanese website and they will show you one day pass is this code two day pass is this code um, if you're using Google Chrome probably uh, it will automatically translate everything from Japanese to English so it's pretty easy to go on from there uh, you just need to remember or just screenshot the code that you need um, we didn't buy the express pass because I don't feel like we need the, need the pass because probably we're gonna spend the whole day in Harry Potter world. Yeah, so check the website, please. Uh, don't forget because um, the quote that we use, you can't just use that one. When you punch in your name, you can always use English, which is nice because I remember before it only accept uh, katakana, which is the the other form of Japanese characters. Um, so now they can you can just punch in English, which is wonderful. Um, and as for your phone number. Uh, you can punch in the one for your hotel they are not gonna um, call you or anything so far I've never received the call giving the, my phone number to them so um, don't worry about that one so just punch in your hotel phone number then that will be set so leave a like comment and subscribe um, tell us uh, if this is helpful um, and also comment and ask questions if you need to um, we'll try our best to answer it like what we did for the Tokyo Disneyland and shout out for people who liked it thank you um, that is one of our most viewed videos <laughs> and hopefully those, this one will do as well um, yeah, I'll see you next time.